Hey guys, thank you very much for your activity on this video in the form of likes and comments to which I try to respond, although I don't do it right away. Today I decided to tell you a little about such an interesting compound as chromium hexacarbonyl. It is a neutral complex containing a metal atom in the zero oxidation state and neutral carbon monoxide molecules. Chromium hexacarbonyl is white crystals, they are very volatile. Even at a temperature of 20 degrees Celsius you can see a noticeable amount of substance operating in an hour. Chromium hexacarbonyl is combustible, burns in air with the formation of chromium monoxide. If you hit these crystals real fast to above 200 degrees, they can detonate. To do this, I decided to pour them on a hot metal plate. The heated in a test tube chromium hexacarbonyl first begins to sublimate and then decomposes when the temperature rises, giving a chromic mirror to a temperature of about 220 degrees Celsius. Note how the smoke coming out of the test tube changes color to dark grey. It's mostly fine metal chrome. Like all metals in a finely dispersed state, it can burn in air. After complete decomposition of chromium hexacarbonyl, we got a test tube coated with chromium on the inside. This is the main industrial use of this substance, chrome plating. Don't forget to like. Concentrated nitric acid decomposes chromium hexacarbonyl into chromium nitrate, carbon monoxide and nitrogen dioxide.
chlorine is the only halogen of three, two others being bromine and iodine, reacts with chromium hexacarbonyl, decomposing it at room temperature, producing violet crystals of anhydrous chromium trichloride as a result. Thanks for watching guys! I hope you enjoyed it because I am about to show you reactions with tungsten and molybdenum carbonyls. Uh, what do you think? Type uh, something in the comment section. See you next video!